Hi, my name is Carl Haynes. I'm a senior technologist in the dialysis unit at St. Joseph's Healthcare Hamilton. I have been a senior tech for about seven years. Prior to that, I was a tech for 10 years. And a uh, primary job is repairing and maintaining dialysis machines and providing service, uh, dialysis service to the patient. What we have here is the Gambro Artist, now owned by Baxter, Artist Dialysis Machine. And as you can see, it's all tubed up and it's preparing for dialysis here. So this machine is used to dialyze the patient approximately three times a week, three to four hours, forever and ever until they get a transplant. This is the dialyzer, the artificial kidney, and it is in here that the actual uh, exchange of fluid and electrolytes, the cleaning of the blood occurs. It's connected through tubing that's driven by a pump here, which pulls blood. This line is temporarily connected to the machine for priming. But these two lines will be connected to the patient, which will pull the blood from the patient and return the blood to the patient. Once again, driven by this arterial pump. We prevent clotting by the infusion of heparin. And we monitor with pressure for leakage. We have clamps for safety and the pump to stop for safety and alarms to ensure the patient's safety. I'm going to show how we connect the patient to the dialysis machine. So I have disconnected the, the arterial red and venous blue lines and showing that for the patient it would be connected either at the arm or at the chest. The blood is pulled through the arterial line by this arterial pump, goes through some chambers, goes to the artificial kidney which is where the cleaning and filtration occurs of the blood. The blood then passes through and through the venous line and some additional chambers returns to the patient via the blue venous line. I'm going to explain now why we have some different colors, red and blue, and what they signify. So we are mimicking the way we label things in the body, arterial red and venous blue, um, in the sense that in the human body, the heart is the center of the uh, operation. In the dialysis circuit, the artificial kidney, the dialyzer, is the heart of the operation. So what we are doing is taking blood from the patient via this arterial line here, delivering it to the artificial kidney where the, the filtering and cleaning occurs, and then returning it back to the patient via the blue venous line. 